The list of stocks that are expected to see a short squeeze this week is intriguing because RDXP stock or Redbox, Nasdaq RDBX now leads the weekly leaderboard maintained by market analytics firm Fintel. But the organization that recently acquired Redbox, Chicken Soup for the Soul Entertainment or Nasdaq CSSE is just a few spots down. RDBX stock shares fell after the transaction was announced as a result of the negative reaction of retail traders. Shares are down again today, despite the fact that brief attention has kept them generally elevated since. The day started off with RDBX stock falling, and it hasn't stopped since. It is currently down 13% for the day and not showing any signs of recovering. The CSSE stock has been gradually moving upward despite its recent decline. Despite some early volatility, it reached a high of 1.3% today. Since before the deal, short squeeze speculators have been fond of the term red box. Prior to its announcement of plans to buy the DVD rental company, Chicken Soup for the Soul Entertainment slipped under the notice of the majority of analysts. It is important to take a closer look at how RDBX stock affects CSSE shares, RDBX stock, and a new affiliate. RDBX stock took the top spot on Fintel's short squeeze leaderboard last week as well. The CSSE stock has risen 8 spots from its previous position despite remaining stationary. In contrast to Redbox's 99.85, the latter achieved a much lower short squeeze score, coming in at 97.96. Given the latter's history as a short favorite and its larger short float percentage, that is to be expected. Some experts labeled CSSE's purchase of Redbox as a take-under deal when CSSE originally announced it. But it also had the potential to turn CSSE stock from a microcap bet to a moonshot, as Investor Place contributor Thomas Neal pointed out. Redbox's deficit can result in a profit for current CSSE stockholders. The agreement may result in yearly cost savings of $40 million. The company's profitability might significantly increase when coupled with the expansion of its current operations that could be sufficient to drive shares upward. What experts didn't anticipate was that CSSE stock would increase on a short interest following the acquisition of a well-liked short favorite. But it's possible that's exactly what's going on. Although Redbox continues to be a favorite among short sellers, some may have changed their focus as a result of its volatility. RDBX shares started to decline two weeks ago on rumors that investors were losing interest. Following that, it briefly increased before declining once more. The stock has continued to rise for the month, although only marginally more so than its new owner. What will happen to Redbox next? Neil made the assertion that CSSE stockholders would benefit most from the transaction in late May. The RDBX stock might experience a near wipeout, he predicts. Although it hasn't happened yet, it appears very plausible. Redbox's short interest will inevitably decline because short interest can sustain a stock indefinitely. When that happens, the only direction that RDBX stock can go is down. After Redbox interest flattens, CSSE stock is unlikely to remain a short favorite. The organization ought to relish the experience while it lasts. If you found something useful, don't forget to hit the subscribe button, leave a like, and turn on all alerts.